but this is one life and we need to spend it being healthy making good, good decisions and is investing in our health and the way we look and the way we want to feel performance mindset health is that going to change everyone sees nutrition as or a diet as eat less only eat certain things remove all bad things from your diet really you want people to not follow these patterns of behavior that leads them to overeating and having bad relationships with food have been there it fucking sucks like imagine if you can get these results and keep them and always look amazing this isn't about getting you in shape for that, this time frame. This is about getting you in shape and keeping you in shape and getting you progressively better, not just for three months, but forever. And getting you progressively better. This is mega. Not just for <laughs> yes, Jack was my work. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I didn't watch the initial scene probably. I'm watching it again, it's that good. <laughs> <laughs> as you imagine the all-camp variety show at the end of each summer session. Unfortunately, you didn't take over... It's like 11 pounds. It's so much cheaper. So if you're on a budget, white fish. If you season it well, it's the one. Three white fishes, so I like it. <laughs> bag of frozen white fish, which is the cheapest way of getting protein in, really. So you're looking at... Per one fillet of fish, 18 grams of protein and 0.6 grams of fat, so it's so lean. Um, I literally put some pink salt on top and spray it. Cauliflower bag of varieties are from Iceland. They're like 30 calories, but they have a lot of volume to meal. One of these bags of couscous. So these are like my go-to, they're so quick and easy. Um, per half pack, 182 calories. So in a whole pack of these, you've got three grams of fat and 12 and a half grams of protein, which is really good. Wow, 2-2. Two, two. And we haven't watched any of it. <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> there you go, now you have it. Right, how to track your calories in one minute. So you're gonna times your body weight in kilograms by 24 if you're a guy, if you are a girl, times it by 22. That will give you your BMR, that's your basal metabolic rate. Doesn't matter, I need to know that, you don't. And then times that by one of these numbers on the left hand side based on your activity level. So you'll be 1.1, 1.3, 1.5, 1.7. You can go in between if you want to play it safe. Um, and what that's going to do is that's going to work out your TDEE, which is your total daily energy expenditure. Again, don't worry too much about it, but that's basically going to work out how many calories you're burning throughout the day and then you're gonna create your own diet based on the goal you've got set. So that's gonna tell you how many calories you're burning per day, then you're gonna set a 10% deficit on that if you are looking at achieving fat loss. For example, if yours comes to 2,000 calories a day, a 10% deficit for fat loss would be 200 calories slashed from your diet, so then you would follow an 1,800 calorie diet. You are welcome. Still filming. <laughs> <laughs> oh, How to get motivated when you're in the gym. There they are. Here we go then. Change your mindset, change your life. I wanna feel free like a bird in the sky. When he opened his wings of light on by to the beat of a silent drum. That's kicking me.
smoothie bowl, which is Greek yogurt, fruit smoothie, banana, honey and granola, or there's a peanut butter bowl, or there's a Nutella bowl. What do you reckon? Mate, how good does this look? So, we are going to track it, and I'm going to show you how when we get home. I'm going to smash this in first time, I'm fucking hungry. Like a bird in the sky. When he opened his wings of black on by to the beat of my cylinder. So I'm gonna show you how to add that into my fitness pal. I do this thing called quick add. Now when you've used my fitness pal for a while, you can gain like a an eyeball for how many calories and the kind of macro content of a meal. Now it's not accurate to those fill up to the number, but it's better than not tracking at all. So if you are someone using my fitness pal, then this is how you do it. So when you're on to your food diary, I'll show you. So if you go to the three dots in the right hand corner, is that focused? Yep. Click that and then press quick add. Then you can basically put in the carbs, fats and protein content that you think from that meal. There you go. So I would always overestimate. So I, I thought that it was about 400 calories. So I'll put 440. In that meal there's only 15 grams of protein. So what I'll do now, just to bump up my protein for that meal, I'm just going to have a shake. So. That's what I'd normally do. So if you're going for a meal somewhere and it's low in protein content, don't worry about it. If it's what you want, have it. But then have like a protein bar ready or a shake or something just to keep protein high. Otherwise, when you get to the end of the day, you're going to be chasing protein. If your goal is like 180 a day like mine, then I'm, I'm going to be really short and have to eat a fucking shit ton of protein or drink a load of powder. I don't really want to do that. So I'd rather do it gradually throughout the day. Um, then it's easier for me to hit my protein goal, which is super platforms now that enable us to put out a message that someone can take and use personal training wasn't really a thing like I trained seven clients today would I be able to influence them seven people's lives 20 years ago I wouldn't it wouldn't be it wouldn't be possible the greatest investment you'll ever make is in you you need to understand that the minute I realized that was the minute that probably definitely defined the change in my life my vehicle of trying to make a difference like I genuinely try and I, I think I can make a difference in this world or a difference to at least one person and then that compound over time I'm, I'm genuinely that's my that's my mission with what I'm doing with my life like I genuinely want to make a difference in the few people's lives the minute you boss calorie counting the minute you understand more about nutrition the minute you take control of your health the minute you invest in yourself everything I've told you will change your life right Winning way to end the day. There you go. Cheers, Bobs.